Good morning, friends. So today I'm really excited because I get to explore my new city of Riga, Latvia, and we are going to the Central Market, and it happens to be the largest market in all of Europe. So that's pretty impressive, and that means there's gonna be so much food that we get to shop and eat. And you can pretty much buy anything there. So I'm pretty excited to see what kind of interesting people go there and people watch, one of my favorite things, but also um, to see what kind of good finds we can have and hopefully at a good price. So um, yeah, I'm really excited to check this place out. It's right across the bridge. I'm thinking it's about 10 minutes from the old city and uh, it's right by the water. It's gorgeous out, about 75 degrees. Summer here in Lafayette is amazing. It feels like California weather kind of, but I know that the winters are gonna be brutal. So next time you see me, I'm going to be outside at the market. We are actually walking to the market because it is in walking distance to us, which is awesome. Oh, recently found out this city is extremely walkable, especially if you have an Airbnb or a hotel that's right in the center city, because you can cross the bridges to go to the other side and check out the old city. One thing I really like about Riga is that it's extremely quiet, even though it's becoming a very popular spot for tourists. It is the middle of the afternoon on a Saturday and you don't hear any loud noises in the old city. It's just everyone just seems to be going at a slow and steady pace and I really like it. So we just got to the center part of the old city and check this out. It's, just, it's kind of like, I guess, an art exhibit going on with all of these different colorful bears. I'm gonna check it out and see what it's all about. American. So there's hundreds of these bears around me and it turns out each one of them represents a different country. So that is so awesome. I've never seen anything like this. So now we're on the quest to find America and England so we can get our picture next to it. <laughs> They're all in alphabetical order, but they're in alphabetical order in Latvian. So it's a little difficult. It's a little difficult for us to find the ones we're looking for. But look how cool this one is. This is Spain. They're so beautiful. I wonder who the artist is. I need to find out. This is awesome. There we go. My Englishman with the Great Britain bear. You gotta rub its tummy for good luck. <laughs> Here's USA's. It's the Statue of Liberty. <laughs> so we're just strolling along to the market and I swear every corner that I look in looks like this. Basically, we just took a really nice stroll through the old city to get to the Central Market. So, definitely walk there. Enjoy the sights. And then, I'm really excited. I can see the peaks of the hangars. And I'm really excited because I just love to shop, especially for food. The hangars were old Zeppelin hangars used by the Germans. And then they were reconstructed to make the market that people use, thousands of people use, every week. If you need some kind of reference point when trying to find these hangars, you just need to look for this bridge with all of these little humps going on there. Okay y'all, we are entering the market and I already smell a whole bunch of seafood. Oh man, I'm dark in here. Can you see me now? Yes. So, first smell, fish. Because look at this. Fish eggs. Fresh salmon, shrimp. Wow. So yes, it's definitely a huge fish smell going on here, but it's fresh smelling. It, everything looks super, super fresh. And look at this, caviar. Okay, if you're feeling a little bougie, get yourself some caviar for cheap. Six euro. 
$8.90, 10 Dang, girl, dang. So obviously we're in the meat section of the hangar, which is the very first hangar when you first walk in. We're not that about bothered about getting meat today because we're going to lunch afterwards, and that would be a no-no. So just so you know, the first hangar when you walk, walk in is full of all of this, a ton of meat. Okay, a ton of seafood and a ton of meat. Just bought some spices from some a very nice lady at really good prices, and now we're going on the search for some produce. walking through all five hangers and now we are outside with even more stands of produce. This is what I wanted to see. All of the fresh fruits and vegetables. Like about this is there seems to be independent sellers all out here so you can literally just go to each stand which is pretty much selling a lot of the same things and compare prices so you get the best deal as i mentioned before you should definitely look around different stands for better prices because we just went to a stand and got raspberries for three euros for a pretty large punnet and then we just saw another one and she was charging six euro for the same size. So look around before you dive in by from any one stand. So now we're in the section of the market where you can buy, it's kind of like the flea market part. <laughs> Dominic calls it tat, which means crap. But uh, I don't agree with that because there's lots of hidden treasures here that you can find. So you can get clothes, jewelry, bags, you know, all of that stuff that you could find at a normal thrift store, but it's outside at this market. Okay, so we just got home and I wanna show you what we got at the market. So, we got this big thing of raspberries, small thing of blueberries, local honey, turmeric, taco seasoning, smoked paprika, and what is that? Cinnamon? And then um, fresh cilantro and green onion. And so all of that costs about 16 euro. So I hope you guys enjoyed that video when we went to the Central Market and got all of those goodies. And if you're ever in Riga, you should definitely visit that place because it's awesome. You can find anything you want for cheap, um, especially if you have an Airbnb or a hotel where you wanna cook your own food. So I will see you guys in my next video. We uh, went to get lunch at a Latvian restaurant and had Latvian food and it was delicious. So I will catch you guys in my new video. Bye.